politics, entertainment stories, current affairs, and exclusive interviews. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome on The Buzz UG with, with Melanz Mino, Mino, a.k.a. Fuller. Well, my name is Melads Milo, a.k.a. Fuller. Very precise and accurate to the point right here on The Buzz UG. And in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe, but also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, let's get the stories started. Uh, this lady, Bushira Najuko, 24 years, is missing and her family is in a panic mode. Uh, she went missing right here in Kampala two days before her wedding. Uh, the family suspects that uh, she could have been kidnapped for unknown reasons. Actually, the wedding was supposed to happen on Sunday, but it has been called off until further notice. Eh, man, this is so heartbreaking. Uh, if you happen to see Bushir Najuko somewhere or you have information about her whereabouts, you're kindly requested to report to the nearby police station. Otherwise, the family is going through tough times. Now, recently, His Excellency Bobby Wine was on BBS TV and talked about a lot of things happening in the country. Bobby Wine was questioned his thoughts about the anti-homosexuality bill in Parliament. He said it will be passed in Parliament, but President Museveni will use other people to challenge it in court and it will finally be nullified, just like the story was in 2014. Apparently, Castle Malema Virizi has filed a case against the Parliament of Uganda and the Attorney General Chiriwa Chiwanuka for being biased during the proceedings of Parliament. Mabirizi also says the Speaker's threats to the members of Parliament who will vote against the bill threaten citizens' participation in the affairs of government through their representatives. Now, the Queen of Buganda Kingdom, Slivia Naginda Luswata, is trending so big time. Yesterday, the people of Buganda Kingdom and her followers were astonished after she revealed that in December 2010, she was blessed with twin girls. One is called Jed Nakato and the other is Jasmine Babiri. And they were born right here in Kampala. She says they are amazing children and very passionate about people. So she's been quiet for the last 13 years. Wow. I'm actually shocked this time around. Even Fred Kajivilumbuye didn't talk about it. You know, he has always told us that uh, he has drones in the Kabaka's palace. So I don't know where they were this time around. <laughs> but anyway, uh, congratulations to Nabangirika and uh, the entire Uganda kingdom. We have received reports that Swangs Avenue singer Priscilla Zawede, famously known as Azawi, is currently pregnant with her first child. Reports have indicated that she's seven to eight months pregnant and very soon she'll be putting to bed. However, we haven't heard about the father of her child. Otherwise, for now, congratulations and we wish her a very safe delivery. Remember, we are fighting homosexuality. <laughs> now, preparations for Rema and Dr. Hamza Sewinya's wedding are underway. Earlier this year, we received reports that their wedding is coming soon and actually this has been confirmed by Tycoon Godfrey Chirumira, Dr. Sewinya's godfather. Uh, Chirumira in a recent interview said the wedding is happening very soon and hopefully this year because everything is moving according to plan. Chirumira also put to dust reports that the couple is not in good terms. He said all oh, that is Wolokoso. Now, Daddy Andre and uh, Nina Rose are rebuilding their relationship after their public breakup in 2021. In a recent interview on Dembe FM, they both confirmed that they are still very close to each other and are trying to mend their relationship. Me and Daddy Andre are still close friends. When I need him, he's always there for me and I'm always there for him. Don't be surprised when we are together because we are best friends. Well, that is a statement coming in from uh, Nina Rose and uh, good luck to them. Socialite Bad Black through her social media platforms has revealed that she's relocating to the Plus 25 for Kenya, claiming that uh, Plus 256 Uganda is a third world country. She said she's tired of living in a country where everything is the same, yet people brag about how much wealth they have. Well, there you go. That is it on the Buzz UG this morning. In case you have anything you want to say about these stories, just put it down in the comment section. But most importantly, subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melads Milo, aka Fula, and it's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio jungle.